I started performing from a really young age, kind of learning um, classical Indian dancing, um, ballet and violin. Um, yes, yeah, so I feel like it was a really natural kind of progression into music theatre because I just loved being on stage. I don't think I do share Cinderella's love of beautiful footwear. This is what I'm wearing at the moment. It's, it's not great. <laughs> They're pretty, pretty scuffed and uh, I think I'll be pretty excited to get into some glass slippers because um, my shoe collection's not up to scratch. I think the best thing about performing in musicals is that there really isn't any other feeling like it. I don't think I've done any other job that makes me feel the same way as I feel being on stage. It's something really special. The worst thing about being in musicals, I think, would be the time away from my family and friends, constantly being on tour. Um, it's, yeah, a big sacrifice, I think, to spend that much time away but when you love what you do, you just kind of have to do it. I think the best thing about playing a princess is the beautiful outfits. <laughs> The more I listen to the score for Cinderella, the more I fall in love with the show and the music. I think there's so much variety in the score and that's really exciting. And um, funnily enough, In My Own Little Corner was one of the first songs I learned when I started singing lessons at 12 years old. So to be performing that on stage now is just like, I feel like I'm coming full circle. But the Rodgers and Hammerstein musical that I grew up listening to that I just love the score for is The Sound of Music. I really don't have an answer for that. I, <laughs> I love performing so much and you know during COVID I really struggled because I was like there is nothing else that I would rather do 